And it is haul time. Once again, over the weekend, I had a marvelous haul and just a couple things. First up, oh my goodness. It is the Marvel Legends 20, 20 years anniversary of the Toy Biz Company. And they produced some of the more remarkable Marvel Legends figures. They started this whole Marvel Legends thing before Hasbro bought it. I picked up Iron Man, Tony Stark in his classic Iron Man suit. Uh, this one I picked up uh, from Babe's Children's uh, Toy World. If you remember that hobby shop I, I frequent uh, down at Green Hills, they were selling it uh, for $44. And finally, the other thing I picked up obviously is the 20th anniversary of Toy Biz Marvel Legends. Captain America. Man, this was so difficult to find. Luckily, our toys had it and they, they were selling it for 60 bucks. I kid you not. But I thought it was a pretty good price considering the fact that this thing was sold out of almost all the hobby shops. A lot of the sellers had canceled pre-orders because out here in Asia, there was stock cuts for this particular figure. In fact, I asked... Uh, the owner of Babe's Children's World because they get directly from the importer of Hasbro products here in Manila, the ones that in the Philippines, the ones that supply all Toys R Us and Toy Kingdom stores. And there's no word whether they're gonna get the Captain America stocks because they were severely cut. For some reason, a lot of the Asian suppliers, a lot of the Asian dealers had a lot of stock cuts for this figure. And over the weekend, if you look at the online sellers here in Manila, the price for this one shot up to $70. I kid you not. It was going for $60 to $70 online and I was just lucky to get one for $60. I'm happy with it. The question now is, should I unbox and do a review of these figures? Because basically, you kind of already know what these figures are all about. Uh, this one just has a retooled you know, um, chest, torso. Uh, it's got a new head sculpt and a new uh, Iron Man uh, helmet head sculpt. But basically the legs, the arms, the blast effects are essentially some, uh, essentially old uh, pieces that have been repurposed by Hasbro. So it's not a big deal. Captain America, obviously just a big repaint of the 80 years uh, Captain America with the new head sculpt and some effects on the shield all of that but you basically know what you're getting with these figures without unboxing them having said that you know how i feel about mint on card or mint in sealed box uh, figures and collectibles when it comes to hasbro you just won't you just don't know if you got a defective product or not and it's in your best interest to open it up and just have fun with the toys. I mean, that's the whole point of getting these things, right? So do let me know in the comment section what you think of these two figures. Are you guys interested in me reviewing these figures or do you think I don't need to? Hit that notification bell so you never miss out on any of my latest video reviews. And if it's your first time here, please subscribe. Thanks for watching.